Hello YouTube, this is a very quick follow-up video on my last um, LC resonant tank circuit project and what I achieved so far is that I programmed the STM32 so that the uh, N-channel MOSFET that pushes the energy into the LC tank um, will be triggered at 10 Hz and the the pulse duration is exactly 80 microseconds as you can see here and as you would have expected um, this causes a um, oscillation um, a resonance oscillation here and the of course the oscillation is damped this is due to the fact that both the capacitor and the um, um, inductance are not ideal components but real world components that have um, losses uh, inside um, basically th this means that they get warm to a certain extent and yeah this is how the the oscillation looks like I've just discovered one interesting point here and if we take a closer look at the the first relevant um, period here we can see it refers to let's say roughly 1.9 kilohertz and if we then go um, to the next one like this we can see that the the period becomes a little shorter which means that the frequency uh, will be a little higher going to the next one we can see it's even shorter than the previous one and so forth so yeah yeah we can clearly see that this um, period is actually much shorter than the first one um, and in my point of view this is due to the fact that the capacity of this film capacitor is a function of of the voltage of the uh, the amplitude of the um, oscillation here and having a look at the the formula here that determines the um, resonance frequency let's assume that this capacitance here is a, a function of the the voltage so if the the capacity um, increases then of course the frequency drops which means the the frequency will go down um, when the capacity increases which means at the end of the day um, the higher the voltage the lower the frequency and th this this could be one reason why this effect here happens um, but honestly speaking I'm not 100% sure if if you have any ideas um, please drop me some lines at the comment section I will have a closer look at the at these effects uh, on my function generator to, to um, maybe figure out where this effect comes from. So this will be uh, the, the next video. Uh, until then, uh, thanks for watching and please let me know your comments. Thanks.